Hi everyone, this is Asus TUF Gaming BE3600 Wi-Fi router and in this video I'm going to show you how to set it up as a repeater. So, to set up this router as a repeater, you don't need to connect any internet cables to it. You just need to power on the router in the same room as your main router, uh, just next to it, and make sure the Wi-Fi indicators on your router are solid white, like this. Next, the repeater setup can be done from web interface only, so I'm doing this on a computer. Of course, you can use a mobile device, but the web interface is not designed for mobile browsers. It's very inconvenient, so let's use a computer. First, you need to connect your computer to Asus setup network. First connection is without password. Once connected, open any web browser and type in asusrotor.com in the search bar, hit enter, and it takes you to the web interface. In this window, you need to scroll all the way down and then check this checkbox. I'm about the age of 16 years, agree to the terms and conditions. Same in this window, agree. And scroll down a bit and instead of creating a new net network, click on advanced settings. First, you need to create your admin login and password so do this these credentials are very important because if you lost these credentials you will not be able to manage your router in future so write them down and save in a reliable place and next choose operation mode well, this interface is pretty stubborn, so sometimes you need to click two or three times to make things work. Uh, now you can set up your router as repeater, as access point, as media bridge, or AI mesh node. So uh, access point is better than repeater because access point is connected to your router by cable and creates its own Wi-Fi network. So you have better speed, you have more control. So if you have an option to uh, put the cable over through your walls or through your ceilings, uh, select access point and create this one. Uh, Media Breach doesn't cre create Wi-Fi network at all. Uh, it just receives the signal from your Wi-Fi router and uh, distributes it uh, via internet cables. So you can connect game, gaming consoles, TVs without Wi-Fi to internet using media breach. And AI mesh is just AI mesh node. If your rotors support this feature, just click on that, but uh, it's better to do it in Asus rotor application actually. So let's set up the rotor as a repeater, click on that. Next, find your network you wish to extend, click on that and enter your current Wi-Fi password. Click next one more time. Now I recommend you to select automatic IP unless you know everything about these settings, but if you know about these settings, I don't know why do you need my help in setting up router. So select automatic IP for this example and now create your repeater's uh, network name and password. You can stick with defaults or you can delete these RPT abbreviations and create something like mesh network, but this is not actually mesh network. But anyway, all your devices will connect to your router automatically if you keep the same Wi-Fi network name and password as your main router. So click on apply. You can ignore this window. This is a suggestion to create stronger password. Click OK. And internet connection setting is finished. Now your router will be rebooted. And now you can just unplug your router and place it somewhere in Wi-Fi dead zone, maybe in the next room or on the next floor. But keep in mind, uh, your router should be in your main router's range to uh, receive a signal and extend it. Uh, so keep that in mind and enjoy your new repeater. It's pretty powerful. Anyway, I recommend you access point if you have such an option. And if this video was helpful, consider to subscribe to our channel, hit the like button and be awesome. Bye guys.